Hey everyone, Trinkanel here. Welcome back to the channel. It's uh, Thursday afternoon, November the 11th. It's going to be the fifth week in the gun season, so we're going to get after them hard again. It's uh, getting to be crunch time, so it's supposed to be a little rain band coming through tonight, and then in the morning it's supposed to be really nice, uh, sunny, cooler, and if the weather holds true, Saturday and Sunday may be my frost. So north-northwest wind, which is good. I don't like east winds or, you know, whatever, and so... It ought to be good. I hope that uh, the cold weather brings some bucks in and uh, maybe bring some in from a mile and a half down the road because the truth is we don't have any shooters on camera. So we're, you know, we're getting to that point where like we got to have something happen. So hopefully uh, it'll be a good weekend. But either way, we're going to have fun and we're going to try our best to get one on camera for you. So y'all stay tuned.
Hey guys, I figured I'd give y'all a look inside the camper, what it looks like at night. Got all the lights turned on. Got a front bed here. An electrician used to own this camper, so that's why I got extra lights, like this little globe light right here. So y'all seen it before anyway, the dinette, sink area, kitchen, and the back bedroom. It's where I hang out and sleep. And back view towards the front. Got a bathroom right here. Turn back around. Shower. If you ever want to use it, but we don't have running water, so whenever we do it, we use that water barrel up front and kind of bathe that way. And then the bed back up here where Preston sleeps whenever he comes. So, anyway, uh, thought I'd give y'all a look. Y'all seen me pack my fanny pack before. Uh, for the morning hunts, I like to have normally a bottled water to drink, some sort of little Debbie, and then some cashews or some nuts. And that kind of gets me through the morning hunting real long, and then when I get out, I eat some lunch. It's gonna be tilapia tonight with a ribeye and a couple burgers. Tonight, Jared's gonna make us a little, his version of the uh, blooming onion. He's gonna slice it from the top side and leave it connected at the bottom. And then we're gonna grill it, but it's not gonna be fried. It's gonna be grilled, so it ought to be real tasty. We're gonna put seasoning in it. And then, yeah, the rest of the stuff will go along with it. Paper sack. No, we had four though. Man, that showed its face. I'm gonna chop it out of there. I don't care what it kills. This has got humidity in it. It ain't no good? No, it's good. I'm just saying it's got uh -huh. humidity in it. If we get plenty of salt, that'll be plenty. It's got more in there than you think. It got really good. It got really good. I'm gonna give it about two more minutes. Saying Cam took the uh, he, he refused to take the vaccine or otherwise he would have been on New England, but now he's turned with uh, now he went back with the Panthers. Yeah, and then uh, Aaron Jones, or not Aaron, Aaron Rodgers, Rodgers. He, he got caught up in his lies. What did he lie about? I mean, they made he made it out like he had been vaccinated this whole time and he hasn't. Oh, so he lied about the vaccination. I hear yeah. you, and uh, it's caught up with him, but I think he's he's gonna get off with a fine, he'll be playing. I mean, the NFL's going to find him, huh, or the yeah, team is? 14,000. The team, the team's going to find him. Green Bay's getting fined 200,000. Aaron Rodgers getting fined 14,000. Yeah. Oh, wow, that's like 14,000. Yeah, that's nothing to him. Like that's like a dollar forty to us. 14,000. <laughs> right. Okay, first batch of these are done. Log back on there so it'll burn. That was that old wet pine uh, log from last week, wasn't it? Yeah. Gotta dry out and burn again. Until you know you 
You talking about like a text message? Yeah, like how you just deleted his. Oh yeah, I, I mean. Just, you just went through. I mean, it's cooking now. I moved, I closed the heat down, so. I'm going back down there. Mm, now I'm here. Mm. I know you guys love to see it, so we're going to show you. This is Jared, my brother's version of a blooming onion on the grill. Looks really good. French fries, a couple batches. One ribeye steak. Pile of tilapia. A couple deer burgers, 60-40 mix. We're getting ready to eat. Here we go. You hear that? They are, buddy. They're wearing out some We're killing some hogs, ain't they? <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> hey, I might have to ask. I had to do your YouTube channel some good. <laughs> I might have to ask Thurman who that is or Clive. Somebody's shooting hogs. I like the sound of that, and I hope, he, I hope that really was hogs. You no, know, sometimes when I, uh, I'll get an email and it'll tell, uh, it'll show you who subscribes, and sometimes it won't, but, uh, if you get a lot of subscribers in a short amount of time, it won't. But sometimes it'll send you random emails. But Yeah, I'll have to get that list from you and see who from work's doing it. They're, they're telling me they're subscribing, but they're probably just viewing. Well, we went, like I said, from 53 to 73 subscribers in a week, so that's our biggest pickup. But I think it's going to it's gonna take off. Uh, there's a lot of people now that watch it that don't subscribe, so I think eventually if they see enough videos coming in, they'll subscribe. So. Well, I'll tell them guys at work. I mean, like I said, I got some AV guys, and then I got other managers, other folks. Hey, subscribe, like the channel. Right. Woo it's doing good, though. It's got, uh, it's starting to pick up on views. It's got, like, probably close to 4,000 views, and it's got 400 hours watched. So that's good. Oh yeah, babe. Oh, uh, I can believe that. That's looking mighty fine, mighty tasty. I'm gonna need that barbecue sauce, whoever wants it. Oh, look at that. As my good buddy Ted Nugent says from Spirit of the Wild, where have we seen this before? We got some black eyed peas, french fries, two helpings of that. We got some uh, backstrap medallions from a buck we killed last year. Big old thick, one and an inch and a quarter bone in pork chops. Another blooming onion. A couple burgers, 60 40 mix. It's time to do it. All right, guys. Well, the day was pretty eventful, I guess, as far as, for me, personally, since Friday, I've seen more deer this weekend than I have the entire season so far. I've saw, I've seen 12 and 12 Friday morning, Friday evening, and then 10 and 10 Saturday morning, Saturday evening. So I've seen 44 deer, seen a ton of does, seen, eight, seen a couple different eights, a couple different spikes. 
but so far the big one hasn't pulled out of the cut so I, I don't know I don't know I mean all you can do is hunt the does you took all my deer I saw two last night <laughs> two this morning and zero tonight you took all my deer Beating us 44 to 10, dog. 44 to 10. JD, it's like a Georgia have, game. You kind of <laughs> have a slow uh, day yesterday, but today picked up on the deer sightings, right? I mean, kind of did. I mean, not necessarily this morning, but this evening. One this morning, five this evening. I'm going to give it all I got in the morning. You can't, you, you know, all you can do is try. I mean, I'm set up perfect to film a nice big buck if he comes in, but he's going to have to materialize. So. It'll be interesting to see if the wind lays down. So, a real good night. Georgia is on top once again. That's good. What is that going to make us, 9-0 and or 10-0? 10-0. We beat Tennessee. Now we play a, a Division Four school, then Georgia Tech, and the season's officially over, and we'll go to SEC Championship, play Alabama. From there, who knows who we'll play. I'm going to hold true to what I said, and uh, I don't know, three or four videos ago where, you know, before the Braves won the World Series, I feel like if they did that, we're going to win. I really believe that's going to happen now. I, I do. So, hopefully we can pull through and that does that. So Our next two will be a walk in the park, but we'll have to stay injury-free. And then the SEC Championship will be Alabama. Hopefully they don't beat us up and all that. And we come out on top for the National Championship. But it, I think it's going to be Oklahoma is who I think. Yeah, they lost today. Oh, yeah, they lost today, so he's right. I don't know who it would be. Oregon or Ohio oh, State. Yeah, Oregon or Ohio State, one of them two. All right, guys, we're going to wrap this video up. It's been another good weekend. It's uh, Saturday night. We still got to hunt in the morning, but we're all going to give it our best, and hopefully we can uh, get some uh, video footage of shooting one in the morning maybe. But either way, we've had a good time. We've eat good. We have good fellowship, so we're going to – Get warm and sleep good in the campers tonight and uh, have a good day tomorrow. So thanks a lot for watching, everybody. Please like and subscribe to the channel and tell your friends about us if you like what you're seeing. So we'll see everybody on the next video. Y'all take care. Cut. Perfect. Perfect. Great job, guys. <laughs> Great job. I'll have the checks in the mail soon. <laughs> <laughs>